Hello everybody, my name is Michael Fox, and welcome back to Eorzea. Uh, we are doing the summer event today. Today is the last day of the summer event, or actually tomorrow morning is the last day of the summer event. Uh, I did it with my own character on the very first day, but I messed up really bad, and like there was, there was no audio the entire time. I, I streamed probably for like three hours and there was no audio. I feel like an idiot. Um, so I had to reactivate my wife's account, and she hasn't played in a very long time. Because I even did the stupid quest on my my side character that I have. I did it like super quick, and I was like, oh, I'm just going to burn through this without checking checking my video first. So I'm doing it on my wife's character. I got her all dolled out in the summer attire from last year. And we're going to talk to... I did find your shit. We're going to talk to Moyaru Mo... Mayaru Moyaru. We're going to start this summer quest. <clears throat> and I was gonna find some way to just like piece it together with my character too, but you can't view any of the cutscenes in the in the unending journal, so my life was screwed. Uh, but thankfully I got this, so we're gonna do it anyway. Jump to the beach. We got the cool, got the cool bombard up there. You get a splash emote. Why well, have this isn't temperance? How long has it been since a year or more, perhaps? I think last time. Uh, the last time I saw you during the Moonfire Fair. Don't tell me you've forgotten about it already. The festival was originally held to recruit adventurers to combat the Bombard invasion. But we gave them such a threshing, they have hardly been seen since. Bombards or no, we still hold the event each year, providing wholesome fun for the whole family. And that's not all. It's an opportunity members of the Adventurers Guild to demonstrate their skills to fair goers and thereby inspire others to join the ranks. Uh, I bet you know the trick or two, am I right? Uh, you head down to Casa del Sol and show them what real life adventure is like. Uh, what do you get there? You're, uh, just head for the gigantic wooden... Oh, I nearly spoiled the surprise. Well, you just have to go and save for yourself. Uh, trust me, uh, you'll know it when you see it. Talk to the chaperones nearby and they'll have performing feasts, blah, 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 blah. Alright. Alright. Here we are. Sun's shining. We're going to talk to Hermaga. 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 Temperance, how good to see you. That was a terrible voice for him. It's a terrible voice. Temperance, how good to see you, my old friend. The Moonfire Fair wouldn't be the same without you, and I've got a treat for you. I keep forgetting the controls are different. Man, look at it. It's so cool. Rising from the the pristine sands and virgin waters of Costa del Sol, a wooden monstrosity so imposing, so unforgiving, that all but the most courageous will run crying to their mammies. It can only be the Eorzean Nimble Warrior Course. I love that they uh, they went with a Ninja Warrior theme. It's, it's pretty funny, especially since jumping puzzles have been really popular in the game recently. This event is sponsored by the ever magnanimous Master Gurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurgurg
complete the quest. Uh, so you take, take what it takes to be an Aorius Nimble Warrior? Uh, excuse me, I'm here to register for the Aorius Nimble Warrior course. Am I in the right place? You are indeed, but you do realize it's only open to fully fledged members of the Adventurers Guild. No offense, lad, but you seem a little too wet behind the ears to be allowed to join. My brother's going to be the best adventurer in the whole wide world. Well, it's true that I am not an adventurer yet. Uh, if there's one thing I am good at, it is jumping. Will you at least let me try? He has a cat. Cats are good at jumping. Sorry, son. If anything were to happen to you, please! I would give anything for a chance to become an Eorza Nimble Warrior. If I cannot enter, it will break my heart, and I shall throw myself from the top of the tower, and my sister will cry until the end of eternity. And That's a bit much. <laughs> it's not a bit. All right, enough. A word to you. But you don't say I didn't warn you. The Eorza Nimble Warrior course is no joke. If you do yourself a mischief... <laughs> Fuck, I can't read. If you do yourself... If you do yourself a mischief? Is that, like, correct English? No. But since when is anything in correct English? Uh, that's why I get confused so many times, especially when I'm reading this shit out loud. And I... They don't speak in correct English. They've got their weird, like, old English bullshit. Uh, I'll have you hanging from the tower by your tail. Uh, I can't believe I'm doing this. Uh, to be on the safe side, temperance here will go first and show you how it's done. Uh, there's no shame in backing down. Uh, blah, blah, blah. What are you doing, Blaine? Thank you, I should pay your generosity with the aerobatic display of the likes you have seen, never, the world has never seen. Oh, and where are my manners? I am Ruftal, Ruftal Tia, and this is my sister, Rumajala. It is our pleasure to meet you. Should I put food out there? I don't know. I'm looking forward to seeing how a real adventurer tackles the course. And once you are done, it is my turn. I hope you don't fall in the water. Haha. <laughs> you and me both. Now, let Buderfoin know you are ready. And be careful out there, understood? Yeah, yeah, I got this. Complete! You learn emotes flash. That's kind of cool. I, emotes are cool. Emotes are cool that you get. Uh, do I, no, it's, it's not a book I have to use. Alright, so we're gonna go over here. As far as the Orzian time is concerned, that took like two hours to talk to that guy. So there's this. So the Orzian Nimble Warrior. He gets some shitty fireworks. Uh, Butterfly will be your guide. Uh, blah blah blah. Uh, should we face the. Yeah, face the course. I'm not even gonna read it. I'm not even gonna read it, I don't care. All right. Let's see. Get some camera angles right. I really hope I can do this on my wife's freaking keyboard thing. That's your extra test. I guess it is. We're supposed to. I love how there's just people hanging. Shit. Right, triggers. Oh, darn it, I'm just resting. <laughs> these people, these people that have fallen into the water. Uh, I didn't see what he said. Okay, good, I made it that time. Alright, now I talk to this cute Makote girl up here. Hello, lady. Uh, I don't see the back yet, there's a long way to go. Once you cut your breath, head towards the hella da da ba da. Ladies, there's a dude there. More ladies. I do love summer. This one's quite a bit harder. Look at this guy, he's all scared and shit. I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh, that was close. That was close. Uh, I'm gonna turn. Yeah, there we go. Wait, no, I want I want that on so I can see what some of the other people are saying. 
It's another word bubbles. Look at this. He's going so fast over there with his squats. That guy's dressed like a pirate. Pirates lose to ninjas over my dead body. <laughs> That's funny. Nice, clever little jokes in there. Okay. Made it. Okay, I made that. Alright, good. I'm doing alright. Doing alright. Here's Haladanana. Haladanana. Heldena. Delna? Heldelana? Heldelana. She says I'm great. On to the next one. So this is the this is the actual really hard one that's like man, I, I haven't made it up to the top, even on my other character I didn't make it to the very top. Which is not required. Hey, there's still a few people doing it. That's kinda cool. It's way more fun to do it on the first day because of how many people there are. Oops, panty shot there. Gratuitous panty shot. God, it's gonna be hard fuck. Yeah, Blaine, what the fuck? Being a ninja is not gonna help you. There's that guy hanging there, too. Damn it, jumped over it. Okay, this is taking me way longer than it should. Almost there, though. Oh, that was close. That was also close. Oh, made it. You did, I knew you were doing right from the start. I have a feeling about you. More cute cat girls. That is what I'm into these days. Cat ladies. <laughs> Just these days. Just these days. Such a magnificent muscles. Hey, 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 hey. This little top tower, this little Lollafell's preferred as Gurger Gurger Jew is. See, I, I haven't found Gurger Jew. I thought he would be out here somewhere, but I don't know where Gurger Gurger Jew is. Making comments about ladies. Um, so that's that's the basic tower that you have to do for the Moonfire Fair. Um, if you're really cool, you can get all the way to the top. Um, but I'm not really cool, so won't be doing that. I will, however, go finish off the rest of the event. Right. So Hanaga has a new quest for me. This is where you get the uh, essential summer coffer. Uh, the hero has returned watching you. I was watching you entirely from start to finish. A truly breathtaking display if I ever there was one. It was incredible. I'd never see anything like it. I want to try it too. Uh, maybe when you're bigger, Missy. How about you, if all? It's not too late to change your mind. I think not. Witness a tempered, spectacular victory has lit a fire in my soul. Today, I shall fulfill my destiny. Flame and glory, here I come. Wait, there's one last thing. Uh, I have a few words of advice for him, but perhaps I won't need it. Hopefully, we'll learn a thing or two from you. I'm you tempered still, I can't help you. Blah, 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 blah. I'm coming too. Hey, you have the both nice. We have the same night nice force. I don't like jumping in heels. No, you don't have any shoes on. There are always shoes. Well, he looks ready now. Never, ever. Is he actually over here somewhere? I've never, I didn't walk over here last time. I was hoping I would see him. 
No, but I don't see him anywhere. Okay. Let me feet print on the sand. Footprints. No, I don't want to talk to you again. He's ready now. Yeah, I know. He's ready. Shit. All right, here he goes. Look at him. Stretching. Yeah. Yeah, here I go. <laughs> Insta. Hey, quiet down, guys. Blaine, be quiet, please. Fool! Oh no! We have to help him! Look at her tiny little tail. She's got the tiniest little, tiny little kid tail. Fool! Are you alright? I've been, I may have been a little overzealous. Heh. <sighs> After my grand words, what a fool I must look. I still have a long way to go. <laughs> Why? Why are you laughing? It's not funny. You're just a big stupid face. Big yeah, big stupid face. Mom! Maja! Whatever's gotten into her? Just don't stand there and go after her, fool. Right, or, uh... Where did she run off to now? Please help me look for her. Yep, yep, yep. Do, 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 do. She swam across this ocean. Thank God she's safe. Hmm. What's the matter? What's the matter? Go away, stupid face. So you, she won't talk to me. Uh, well, if you leave me no choice, there's only one way to deal with sulky little girls. Hmm? Come on, Temperance. Splash some water on her. Oh, yeah, this makes you use the, the splash emote. Hey, it's cold, tee hee hee hee. So, Miss Sulky Girls, can you tell me what she ran off. I'm sorry, Temperance. You're not cross with me, are you? Yes. I am, you little... Oh. She said no. Uh, it's just that at the festival, my brother's going on a long journey to become an adventurer. Long journey? What gave you that idea? I heard you talking about it with Mummy. I know. And I know how much you want to be an adventurer. You tell me because you thought I'd be sad. You didn't tell me because I thought it'd be sad. I'm right, aren't I? I've known all this time, and it does make me sad, but I want you to be... I wouldn't want you to give up your dreams for me. That's why I told myself not to cry. I thought you'd be upset when you fell in the water, but you were laughing. You're right. I should have taken it more seriously, especially since you and Temperance came to watch me. <coughs> but I am serious about becoming an adventurer. You see, Temperance, we don't have a father, so I help our mother look after <coughs> Malja, and I realized that I needed to become a man, to become strong enough to support my family. I just didn't know how. But I went to the Moonfire Fair a few years ago and saw the Crusaders drive off those dreadful bombards. I discovered a calling in life to become an adventurer. If I were to become as brave as the heroes of the Adventurers Guild, I could protect my family from harm. I could provide for them. My first step towards becoming an adventurer, the Moonfire Fair, presented the perfect opportunity. What better way to prove my worth than by overcoming the Eosian Nimbo Warrior Horse? I was eager to prove myself. I got carried away. And you know the rest. I humiliated myself in front of everyone, so I tried to laugh it off. I don't know what else to do. I never meant to upset you, Maja.
But I haven't given up hope. What do you think, Temperance? If I keep training, do you think that I could make it as an adventurer? I will say positive things. Little acorns. Are you saying that I should become a botanist? Oh, I think I understand now. Yes, I shall do my utmost day to become a great oak. Monty, you were right about a lot of things, that's true, but I'm going to be away from home for a while. And my face, yes, it is probably a bit stupid looking from time to time. I didn't mean it. Your face is fine. How it is. Well, most of the time, anyway. But if you're going away, you will make me a promise. Don't die, no matter what. We're little teeth. We're little tiny teeth. Uh... You don't have to be a hero. Just be just be safe. That's all I want. Very well, Mayor. I promise I will never die. Or, well, not anytime soon, at least. Now that's settled. I think it's time to go home. Thank you so much. See you again. Wait! Don't go running! Oh, not again. Before I chase after my sister again, I'd like to thank you. You're a kind adventure. You're the kind of adventurer I aspire to be, and it was an honor to meet you. There was one thing I've learned: it is that actions speak louder than words. That's right, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, yes. Maybe you inspire to the strong, silent type too. Something I work on as I embark on my journey. But before I leave, I would like to spend some time with my family. Please give my regards to Hermaga and the others. Tell me meet again. <clears throat> Blah, 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 blah. Ah. Oh, endless summer fun. Alright. Now we just have to go talk to Hermaga. Welcome back. Hope it is all well. Oh, he decided to become an adventurer after seeing the Moonfire Fair. Well, isn't that a testament of the festival's power to inspire? I don't know what is. It wars my, wars the chronicles of my heart. It does. Uh, and as for you, you helped make the festival a huge success. After all the casualties we've had, I was worried that we would blah blah blah. I don't care. Just give me my shit. Tonight the stars align. So. Let's put on this new summer gear. So here's this year's summer gear. Uh, the girls look really cute. It's really cute stuff. Uh, cute little bikini bottom with some neat little flowers on it. And then uh, it's like a, a bathing suit top, but it's got some little frills on it. And then you do got the glasses, the sunglasses. Um, and then those summer sandals, which are kind of cool. The female ones have a... Uh, looks like they wrap around the ankle, which is kind of neat. What I also thought was really cool is you can backslash visor these, and you can uh, have the sunglasses raise up onto your forehead, which I thought was kind of a neat thing. Here's the summer attire for uh, the male counterpart. Uh, same colored shorts, uh, they're like just regular shorts, cargo shorts type of thing. Got the same flower design on there, cool open hipster shirt, and then the same, same sunglasses. Uh, and then the shoes are just um, some generic. Generic flip flops. So you can talk to the Moonfire vendor here. Uh, she sells some fireworks, uh, a tabletop furnishing that's a, a food, and then a mosquito moogle. Uh, I'm gonna, I have that in my house, and I'm gonna show you guys that right now before we leave. So there's your moogle, your moogle mosquito, mosquito moogle. It's basically just a uh, like a little incense burner type thing that keeps mosquitoes away. Uh, Why well, it's an indoor furnishing? I don't know, uh, but it's, it's kind of cool looking. You can see the little coil inside, and it's it's got a little flame there. It's burning, and there's some smoke coming off of it. And it looks just like a a weird fucking cat moogle. Looks like a weird cat moogle with its mouth open really wide. But that's the end of the uh, Moonfire Fair 2018. Um, overall, overall decently fun event. I like the I like the gear. I like that you can do the thing with the the sunglasses, which I think is really cool. Um, 
was a fun of like the the jumping puzzle idea was a, a fun idea. A lot of people are saying that it's it's lame and it's kind of a a cop out or whatever from SE. Uh, but I kind of dug it and I, I like the. Uh, I'm a big fan of Ninja Warrior. I've been watching that since like the G4 days, and I think it's it was a cool thing to have it uh, kind of mixed in with Final Fantasy 14. I thought it was fun. Um, let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Hope you enjoyed my video. Um, let me know what you think of this year's Moonfire Fair 2018. Until the next video, guys, please be kind to each other, and I'll see you guys next time. Logical high five.